Welcome back fellows. Today we are going to look at unique um, function in Microsoft Excel. Unique function um, returns a list of unique values in a, in a list or a range. So it is different from the usual unique functionality that you perform um, using multiple functions. So let's have a look how you can do that using this. So the code itself or the function um, narrative itself is, is equal to unique that you can see returning the value of the array um, over there you can um, visualize that so what i will do is i will select from d5 till the end and i will close the parenthesis it will give me only unique values in this um, by the way just to remind all of you that this functionality is available only in office um, 365 subscriptions so this is one way of using unique feature. Now we are going to unique, use this unique in a, in a different way. So let me undo this and let me type um, function sort, if you remember, we used it. And then um, unique in that. This is kind of a nested function now, sort and then unique. And when I use this to select the same um, range that we did, and now let's have a look at it. I'll close it twice. There you go. Now it is sorted. So this is yet another way to use this. Sort, then unique, and the same um, uh, function uh, description that you have, you will use that. Now, this was um, yet another way to use a unique feature. I will share with you another feature to do that. For example, if I want to see in the list of um, multiple, um, I'll say, customers that I have, and I want to see which one is a, is a one-time customer, let's say. This, is, this will be true. So how can I figure out in these um, customers which one is my one-time customer is equal to unique. I will type the same um, um, description or functionality, invoke the same functionality, and then I'll have to select um, both my service type um, but selection of this description will be only uh, that particular uh, column. Then I'll put true and then I close the parenthesis. Once I do that, I'll be able to see only the one-time customers in this particular um, functionality. Now, in this functionality, you must have seen that I've selected table. So I've used a table and I've demonstrated here that you can use a tab, table as well to pull in the data or the information. Um, going forward, I would also like to share with you how you can compare two um, columns in one a unique functionality. So for example, we have multiple uh, salespersons here. We have a certain regions as well. So we'll pick unique um, in terms of the region and sales personality, how we can pick it up. I will show you is equal to unique function this time you'll select both sale person and region to take a unique value between these two and you will close this there you go now you have been able to pull in two unique um, values in multiple columns fellas this is quite interesting i hope you enjoyed it um, just try and practice it on your own PCs as well and do let me know your feedback in the, in the, in the comments section below. I look forward to see you again. Till then, uh, take care of yourself, stay safe and, um, and, and, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Ciao, ciao.